In this video, we're going to look at photographing a basic t-shirt for e-commerce. To make the t-shirt the style, we've styled it with a simple pair of jeans. This way, the t-shirt, the thing we're actually selling in these pictures, is going to be the star of the show. But we want something that complements the outfit uh, and is comfortable and casual, just like the t-shirt. The makeup is quite neutral in this. Uh, you know, we haven't gone with any fancy stuff, just to, again, it's e-commerce and we don't want to distract too much from the products that we're selling. We're going to use our main key light over here, and I'm just going to soften it down by adding a reflector here, so the light from this side, our key light, is going to be reflecting in and lighting up the whole area. So let me just tilt my key light a little bit more. So that's away from the model now, but we're getting an overall nice even light across the whole stage. This is a really nice bright environment now, and it's going to suit a range of products that I might have to shoot throughout the day. Take care that you have framings set up so you can get back to them, say the outfit, the full outfit, and any crops for tops. When we shoot our full outfit, what we want to make sure that we do is have the camera at a decent height, sort of towards the middle of the body, so that we're not distorting the top half or the bottom half of the body. For the close-up, the crop shots that we're going to do, we want to be around chest height with the camera. We might want to also just tilt the camera slightly towards Juliet, down from that chest height position. So throughout the shoot, you might want to make small adjustments if there's any creases, just making sure that we pull down the t-shirt. It's really key if the model moves further towards you or further back on the set to make sure that you keep refocusing. Can I turn you just towards the light a tiny bit more? Just want to catch a few of those sequins in the t-shirt. That's lovely. And then stay with your shoulders in that position, but just turn your head to the camera. That's great. So continually adjusting the t-shirt, making sure it's not getting all creased up and just changing from pose to pose. Okay, we just got a little bit of upturn on the bottom of the t-shirt. Let's try having both hands down by your sides for a second again. That's lovely. And a little bit of a shoulder turn. So we got something quite neutral. We've got a really nice pose here with the legs looking great. Uh, and we can see the t-shirt and a beautiful smile. And then we might zoom in and grab a detail just to show off the sequins and any other stitching details or pattern details that might be on the product. So I'm happy with the front shot now. We're just gonna go ahead and shoot the back. So one there and then yeah, you could, if you turn your head more towards me, that's great. And halfway between, so just seeing the profile of your face. That's really nice. Great, so we got that. So combining all these tips will help you get consistent, clean imagery for your website.